This farm is growing crops using a water source that won't run out. British startup Seawater Solutions is running a pilot project on the west coast of Scotland, preparing farmers for the worst effects of climate change. Solar and wind power are used to flood the field with seawater twice a day to mimic the tide. Yannick Nyberg is the company's director. So we're guilty, even here in Scotland, of believing that we're immune to the, the threats of climate change. The last year's drought really highlighted the, the threat that this represents. That fact that we can grow food using the most abundant resource in the world, that really piqued my interest. Um, but qu pretty quickly after that, we realized there was so much more to it. Not only that these plants can create ecosystems and promote wildlife, but they can also feed us in a sustainable way. Crops being grown include samphire and sea blight across an acre of land belonging to farmer Jay Crawford. We've taken a piece of land here that's maybe only going to yield a couple of hundred pounds per, per year into something that could maybe yield a couple of thousand pounds per year. Greengrocer George Chubb says demand for more eco-friendly products is on the rise. Well, something growing in the sea is quite, a, quite an easy crop to grow. It doesn't rely on a heavy industry of farming, so it's really good for the environment. Uh, and because of the extreme taste that it brings to your meal, uh, it's really, really popular because of its eco sort of uh, credentials. Growing populations, more farming and a rush of people to cities is increasing pressure on the world's limited fresh water supplies. UN data shows two billion people, a quarter of the world's population, are using water faster than natural sources such as groundwater can be replenished.